Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. I've got a busy day today so I thought I'd start vlogging. I'm just doing my makeup um, and this is probably going to be the start of like a longer vlog. Basically this is going to go up slightly later so it won't be this exact time frame but as I'm filming this at the beginning of September we're getting our new puppy in a week. Um, so we've basically got to spend today kind of getting ready for her um, and we've also got some stuff we need to get for our current dog Bella as well so I think we're gonna go to like this kind of farm shop um where they sell really nice dog stuff and like maybe try to get a dog bed and stuff we are also going to see Poppy um which is the name of our new puppy today I don't know if I'll film anything I'll see but I'm hoping anyway that this vlog will kind of feed into when we pick her up and bring her home so this should kind of be like preparing for her and then actually picking her up and having her home so yeah i'm just getting ready for the day i do need to try get some pictures today because i'm falling behind on my content like for instagram and stuff like i've got enough at the moment but i need to top up because even though i'm gonna have content from getting poppy and stuff i still need to stay on top of like my normal stuff so I'm hoping I can try get some pictures today. And the thing is with the weather, I mean, by the time this goes up, I expect it'll be freezing or whatever, but I expect it to go into September and it'd be like, right, I can start being autumnal, but it's literally gonna be like almost 30 degrees next week. So I'm so stuck with like what to post and what to wear because obviously I wanna, still like post what i'm wearing currently so it will still be like summer outfits but then i also want to start posting inspiration for autumn but it's kind of hard when it's 30 degrees it's like today the outfit i'm planning to wear is just black and white so i feel like i'm wasting the use of like a sunny day to wear a sunny outfit but at the same time we are transitioning into autumn so i do need to start phasing out the summer outfits but i don't know i'm kind of ready for autumn anyway it's just gonna be a weird stage at the moment of posting some like summery stuff and some autumn stuff kind of together concentrate and do my mascara okay makeup is done i'm gonna try my outfit on um because i don't know if i'm really feeling it and then we need to walk bella to the vet just because she needs some flea treatment so hopefully i can get some pictures on the way so at the moment i've just got this top from zara on it's like all backless and then some jeans that you can't really see but i think i'm gonna put a score on because I won't be able to wear like this kind of thing soon when it starts getting cold so I need to make most of it. So it's this white one from Sisters and Seekers because this kind of thing you can't wear tights with it in autumn and like make it autumnal really so it's kind of just a summer thing. Okay I actually really like this outfit you still can't really see um but yeah it's kind of giving sporty vibes but I'm gonna wear my fave combo just to make it a little bit more summery just because it's sunny. shopping to get all the puppy stuff ready um so i was just gonna do a little puppy haul we also got some different bits for bella as well starting off strong she's got a little denim jacket i just had to i couldn't leave it i don't know how long it's gonna fit her for it'd be too big at the moment and then it'll probably fit for like a week and then she'll grow out of it but it's adorable and it's gonna be like autumn winter and she'll fit into it so hopefully she'll wear it so that was from Pets at Home then, also from Pets at Home we got this tug toy because Bella had this when she was a puppy and she really liked it as well. She liked it now. And then we got one of them bowls that like, I don't know, pops open and closed. Bella's got one and we use it all the time, like just taking it out on walks and stuff. And then we went into TK Maxx and she's got this little, I think it's meant to be a monkey. It's like this little toy, I thought that'd be cute for like her little puppy toy. And then we also got her like a more useful one little blanket i might pick her up in this or I might use it in her crate or something i don't think it's going to be that big it'll be more like a little puppy one and then we got this little like kind of more shallow bowl um for her to eat out of and a kong and then lastly for bella boring but she's being really fussy with her food so we've just um got some more dry food and some more wet food to try her on so we're just on the way to go and pick up Poppy now. It's the 
next September at 12 and when we get back we've got to introduce her to Bella so I'll see how that goes and whether I can vlog it. We've got her little lead with flowers all over her and this little blanket to bring her home in although it is the hottest day of the year so I doubt she's going to want it but I don't want her peeing on me. We've just picked her up. She's not really sat on the blanket or the towel, so if she needs to go to the toilet, it will be on me. But she's comfy, so I'm leaving her. Okay, yeah. We've just introduced them and it's actually going way better than we thought it was going to go. 